Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how to make green pea kachori. Now let us see the ingredients required for pea, uh, green peas kachori. This is a coarse paste of uh, half kg green peas. Then a juice of a lime. Then this is a paste of say about 10 pots of garlic. 1 inch ginger and say about 4 to 5 green chilies. Now green chilies depends on your taste. Then this is the powder of 2 tablespoon of coriander seeds and 1 uh, tablespoon and little on the top uh, soft fennel seeds. So I have uh, uh, made a powder together. Then these are 2 small onions finely chopped and some coriander. Now let us begin to make this uh, covering, uh, the filling of the kachori and for the outer covering of the kachori I will be using maida, all purpose flour, let it rot and salt according to taste. Now let us begin, the oil has become hot, I will put the flame to the lower. Now first I will be adding onions. You just have to saute it, do not turn it brown, just the raw taste should disappear, that's all. Just for say another uh, 3 minutes to uh, make. Now see, the onion has been cooked, it has turned little its color and it has become translucent. At this very point, I will be adding the paste of 4 to 5 green chilies, 1 inch ginger and say about 10 pots of garlic. So that uh, solution or that powder I am going to add. Sorry, not powder, that, is, that paste. And let it cook. You have to continuously go on stirring it, otherwise it will stick at the bottom. Now at this point, I will be adding this coarse paste of green peas and you have to go on continuously stir it. Otherwise, it will stick down and it will not put the flame to the lower, to the lowest and keep stirring it. Continuously, you have to go on stirring it. Now I will allow it to cook for say another 5 minutes. Process till now. I have initially I have taken 2 ladles of oil and into that I have added 2 uh, small onions finely chopped. When they are cooked, I have added the paste of 10 pots of garlic, 1 inch of ginger and 4 to 5 green chilies. After the, uh, it has been cooked, I have added the coarse paste of a half kg of green peas. I have allowed it to cook by putting a lid onto the wok and I have cooked till the moisture has disappeared. Now at this point, I will be adding a masala powder which is made from 2 tablespoons of coriander seeds and 1 tablespoon of fennel seeds that is soft and little on the top. So that I will be adding. And I will be adding salt for taste. So that I will be adding two and a half teaspoons. Now I will mix it.
care is to be taken that when you are cooking this the gas flame should be lowest otherwise it will stick down now after i have mixed all these spices i'll be adding finely chopped green chili uh, green coriander and the juice of half lime and i will mix all this together now this is this mixture is now ready to be filled in into the outer covering which will be made with maida now i will show i will allow this to cool after cooking the coarse paste of uh, green peas i have added spices the spice powder that has been made with coriander 2 tablespoon coriander and 1 uh, tablespoon of fennel seeds and i have added uh, half lime juice and freshly chopped coriander and i have allowed the mixture to cook for another 8 minutes now i have kept the solution this filling for cooling down now let us make the outer covering for the kachori i have here i have taken Uh, 500 grams of maida all purpose flour into this i'll be adding 2 and a half teaspoons of salt ah now the thing i have uh, uh, tasted this uh, filling and i found uh, the salt level was little uh, less so i have added another uh, half teaspoon of salt so total i have added 3 teaspoons of salt into this mixture now i'll just mix all this together and into this mixture i'll be adding this hot 3 ladles of oil see Three total three. And using water, I'll be kneading the dough. The dough should be little tougher than what you make for puri. Okay, it shouldn't be very uh, soft. It should be hard, harder than make ma ma made for puris. see i'm mixing all this so that i'm getting the texture like bread crumbs that means is been see you how i'm getting the texture like bread crumb so when i'm doing it like this see that means the oil that i have put inside the uh, this powder the solution is perfect now using water i will need the dough dough should be harder than normal made for normal puris see now i have made this dough it should be this thick see it's not soft it's this thick now i have already made some kachoris now i'll show you how to make one i have taken this big uh, pea, uh, portion of the dough and i'll just roll doesn't make any difference even if you couldn't uh, roll it properly circle it's not going to affect okay now i'll take a sumptuous spoonful of solution i'll take this into the hand and then i'm going to fill it like this and then what i'm going to do is i will press this down 
and go on making it go right in C it should be like this it should be made like this go on pressing this solution inside okay like this see you have to feel it like this and then bring it together and the remaining one you just put it back yeah here it is now you press it it shouldn't open here if it is opening take another small piece and just paste it here that's it it should be sealed from all the sides and just go on pressing it with your hands no need to take a uh, roll it onto the rolling pin just you have to press it like this and see it has got the round shape yeah okay this is done now the oil i have already made little hot now i will fry i will put the gas flame to the lower middle and then i will fry them see you can put two at a time see it's see i have fried kachoris each kachori i have fried on a low flame minimum for 10 minutes it should have this color and this kachoris are to be served hot along with chaat imli chutney or say your tomato sauce or say you can have this along with curd also uh, in the curd you can add little salt and little roasted cumin powder and you can mix and then serve it along with uh, these kachoris these kachoris are well suited for the children's party or the tea time snack if you like my recipe see these look like this if you like my recipe kindly share it with your friends subscribe my channel write your comments in the comments box and click on to the bell icon thank you